Yes, my people, what is good? Welcome back to the channel. Today we are talking about a shoe that I think is going to be making a huge return over the summer months. Of course, I'm talking about the Jordan 1 Lows. We've been seeing some absolute bangers when it comes to this silhouette over the last couple of weeks. Today I have one of the latest colorways on the channel. This is the Marina Blue, and this is one of the cleanest colorways I've seen in a very long time. Check this out. Yes, people, I hope everything is good with you. So in today's video, I'll be reviewing the Jordan 1 Low in the Marina Blue colorway. This is such a nice shoe. I'm going to be looking at the shoe in more detail. We're going to be looking at the colorway, the materials used, sizing. I'll be talking about resale and what I think this shoe will be reselling for over the next couple of months. And I'll be giving you the on feet look as well. So make sure you watch the entire video for that as well. Let's get straight into review. Over the past couple of months, Jordan brand has been dropping a bunch of Jordan 1 Lows and each one they just been getting better and better each time i've picked up quite a few of them and for me i think this is probably the best colorway we have seen so far this blue this white it goes so so well together this colorway is one of the cleanest nicest colorways we've seen so far obviously i had the cardinal red i had that shadow colorway as well which is pretty nice but i think this incredible very very nice i love everything about this shoe the way the color blocking on this shoe just it just hits so different i like it the blue outsole the white midsole everything about this shoe is just incredible and as i said before one of the things i love about the jordan one lows is that wings logo that is stitching on the back especially in a bright white colorway it's just incredible and for me this shoe is just amazing i've picked up quite a few of these as i said before and all of them we have not seen the best leather and i think this has a different leather to all the others i've picked up so far the leather on this is actually pretty nice feels very soft feels like some very buttery leather on here for a change but as i said before the jordan one low is definitely the one for the summer so these sneakers dropped a couple of days ago in the uk retail was 100 pounds as it usually is and it is a bargain at £100 for this colorway in my opinion because these are incredible. I managed to grab my pair from the Nike app which is where I get all my dunks, all my Jordan 1 mids, Jordan 1 lows, everything. I go to the Nike app and I always seem to, to hit on there so I'm not complaining. I have been getting very lucky on there. In regards to this shoe, that's the only place I actually saw these. I didn't see these at any other retailers apart from the Nike app which kind of lets me know that they might be a little bit limited. but. I could be wrong. But anyway, this is a shoe that I think is well worth the £100 price tag. The materials are incredible on here, as well as the, the colorway. The colorway is really great as well, so 100% justified. So as I mentioned before, this shoe does feature some really nice materials. And we're gonna be taking a closer look at them. So we're gonna start with that toe box. You get a white leather toe box, very buttery leather on there as well. Feels very, very nice. You come to that mud guard. The mud guard is done in that marina blue colorway and it is done in the exact same leather as that toe box feels very nice as well you come to the side of the shoe you get the underlays of the shoe done in white leather the overlays like the, the swoosh is stitched in in blue leather feels very nice as i mentioned before the eyelids are also in blue and you come to the back of the shoe which is probably my favorite part of the jordan one lows you get that wings logo stitched in white over the blue overlays pretty cool in my opinion you come to that midsole the midsole is done in white the outsole is done in that marina blue and it looks like a bit of a darker shade of marina blue on the bottom looks feels very premium you come to the lace the laces you get your usual jordan one laces and it's the same on the jordan one mid and the jordan one low jordan one high exactly the same lace you come to the tongue the tongue is done in this nylon type material very soft and obviously you do get your jump and logo stitched in blue on the tongue as well and i think all in all this shoe is absolutely incredible the sock liner feels very soft as well feels like there's a bit of silk in there it feels very very soft but yeah amazing shoe very very nice shoe to be rocking this summer so let's talk about sizing and when it comes to sizing i always suggest going through to size every time you're buying a jordan one low jordan one mid jordan one high jordan 185 
go through the size it fits absolutely perfect i actually went through the size in this shoe for a change and it fits absolutely perfect fits really really well on feet so when it comes to resale i actually do see these shoes slightly increasing in value over the next couple of months so currently these sneakers are reselling for around 120 to about 150 in most sizes that is a price I do expect to rise as soon as everyone gets their pairs and start reselling them. The price will come down slightly, but I do expect, give it two, three months, these will start around that 150 mark, going up to about 200 in most sizes. And I expect the smaller sizes to do a lot better than the bigger sizes as well. So this is a shoe I wouldn't personally invest in because I wanted this for my personal collection. But if you're gonna invest in these, go for the smaller sizes, and I expect you should make money on these, but that's just my opinion. So my final thoughts on a Jordan 1 Low in the Marina Blue colorway. One of the cleanest colorways we've seen this year, probably the best Jordan 1 Low we've seen this year. And it has some very fierce competition, especially from that shadow colorway, that cardinal red colorway as well was pretty nice. But I think this is probably the best one we've seen this year so far. Very, very clean colorway. And as I said before, this shoe is very wearable, perfect for summer. It's just a great colorway in my opinion. So in that case, I think this shoe is 100% must cop. So, a must cop. Yes, people, that is it for the video today. I hope you enjoyed it and found the information useful. If you haven't already, please hit the subscribe button below and hit the bell so you don't miss any of my uploads. The on feed portion of the video is coming now. Thank you.